Adam Lambert is more than an American Idol star. He's a beacon of hope. That big, beautiful smile, those great blue eyes. And I'm very proud to present Adam Lambert with the Hope of LA Award. Thank you guys. Um, I was saying last night at the party outside um, that when I first auditioned for American Idol, I just wanted to sing. That's all I was going for. You know, I was like, I need a, a record deal. And then once everything happened and I got off the show, I started, you know, thanks to social media and other outlets, I started connecting with fans. And I started hearing all these stories about people that didn't have the best situation when they were growing up. They dealt with uh, homes and families that didn't accept them, communities that didn't accept them. And I felt fortunate and a little guilty because I came from a very, very good home um, and had been doing theater my whole life and had been in a very safe environment. So what I realized was that I could use my celebrity, I could use my platform for good. And I could use it to help people feel safe and to feel included and to feel like they had a voice. Um, and so since then, I've been trying to get involved in as many things as I can. Um, I feel like it's my responsibility, and I'm really thankful for uh, being recognized for that. So thank you guys so much. Thank you. Cheers. Thank you. Thank you. I am a tremendous American Idol fan. And that day that you, I guess, slicked your hair back or greased your hair back and put on a white tuxedo and sung Smokey Robinson. <laughs> that was a phenomenal night. And I can't remember the, the other song that I really um, fell in love with about uh, people going places or if you did it in the uh, semi, finals, uh, and I think it's kind of funny, I think it's kind of strange that, anyways, I just loved it. Hear me now, because this might be of some importance. When they come down to the finale, I might have had people that I hoped would win, but I never knew who was going to win until it was Adam and the person that he competed with, who was good, and Adam came in second. And the only reason why you didn't come in first, in my opinion, is because you were gay. And that ain't right. You should have won, it was a runaway. So what you're doing now to help uh, uh, young people throughout the country is phenomenal. Adam, I want you to come up here. I have to take a picture with you. <laughs> sergeants, where are my sergeants? Sergeants, sergeant at arms, Adam is not allowed to leave until after you bring him here. And where's Betsy? Betsy, I want the best shot that you got.